stay tuned to see how I got it like this. Thank you. I already shampooed with a Herbal Essence Bourbon and Manuka Honey Deep Repair. My hair is now ready to be deep conditioned. In my hair now is the Oosie Miracle Moist Conditioner with Macadamia Nut Oil and the Tresemme Bantini Coconut Oil and Aloe Vera. I ran out of the Oosie Moist, that's why there's a mix. There are days where I purposely mix conditioner together and apply it on my hair. I generally deep condition under a cap between 30 minutes to 1 hour. Today I deep conditioned for about 45 minutes. My hair is nice and warm, ready to be detangled. The best time for me to detangle my hair is after a deep condition, all because my strands are much softer and can glide through the wide tooth comb much easier and all shedded hair is released better. I gently comb through and section where possible to avoid breakage. I do the exact same thing all over the hair. Once the hair is detangled, I rinse out the deep conditioner and immediately, whilst my hair is wet in the bathroom, I don't towel dry my hair. Once it's rinsed, I apply a leave-in immediately by Miel and Curl Maker by Camille Rose and I put my hair back in its sections in the Bantu knots then to give my curls more definition I apply the olive oil eco styler gel which gives my strands hold as well I do four things in these last stages of the wash and go I section, comb, apply the gel then massage the gel into the strands until I feel it clump to thicker single strands curls or I shingle it myself which is what you're going to see me doing here. My hair is in bantu knots throughout the whole process so that the leave-in and the curl maker I added previously can sink well into my strands and hold up the water from previously since I don't towel dry. As I begin a new section I unravel the knot and I'm satisfied with how wet my hair is and that's why I don't use much of the water spritz. It takes about one to two hours to complete the wash and go. It depends how well you have mastered it really or how small or large you section which contributes to how long the whole wash and go process takes. So the process just repeats itself really. I just comb. Combing the hair releases the hair from any tangles and helps the gel to slide through the hair better. Massaging the gel into the strands helps the curls to be well defined. You find they begin to clump to single, single thicker curls after if you massage for a longer period. And or I just shingle if I don't wish to massage for too long. I do the same thing till the process ends really. As you can see, um, two sections are complete there and they're already drying. You find that water weighs natural hair down and as it dries, the hair just springs back up. Oh la la, oh la la, oh oh oh, oh la la, oh la la, oh la la, oh oh oh, oh la la, oh la la, oh la la, oh oh oh, oh la la. Now it's complete, yay! Hi everyone. And these are the results of my wash and go. I'm really loving the style. I love how it came out. Look at these curls. Wow, look at that. I love the shape. It is still damp, I don't mind. I don't mind that it's also shrunk as well. I love the shape it's come out to be. It looks really good. It looks nice as well. Back, I'm sure. It's fantastic. I really appreciate this style. I remember when I took this, this style to work for the first time and all my colleagues were like, I love your style, Abby. Keep your hair like this, Abby. Keep it like this. It looks good. Yes, and since then I've also embraced it. You know, when you get good remarks, you feel, you feel encouraged and motivated 
to do more. Yeah. I as well. I, I like it. It actually fits my face. I really do appreciate it. But this is one of my best hairstyles this year, 2019. Yeah, it's probably my 10th or 11th wash and go this year, 2019. But I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Looks good. I'm watching. I've been watching lots of Kimberly, Kimberly Shirelle YouTube videos. So I'd like to say hi, Kimberly. Thank you for the videos you post. It's really helped. I did a combo. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Thanks.